The biggest struggle of being a two-sport athlete is time management. I have to always be working hard the whole year, always be balancing my sport and my homework at the same time. My name is Michaela Grady. I'm a sophomore and I do women's soccer and track and field. In track, I compete in the heptathlon, which is made up of seven events. It's the 100 hurdles, the 200 meter, the 800 meter, long jump, high jump, javelin, and shot put. I really enjoy the heptathlon because the difference with soccer is there's always something new to work on in terms of events. I always have to transition from one skill to another. I'm Heather Creer. I'm the head men's and women's track and field and cross country coach at BLU. I feel, I haven't talked to Michaela about this, but I feel that Michaela would get bored uh, if she didn't, if she wasn't running around with her head cut off all the time and busy. I know that college life is busy to begin with, but she thrives off of that. I mean, more than other athletes. Um, I've had heps in the past who are very methodical and they like their little routine and don't mess with the routine. And she's resilient enough to adapt to different things. For example, today we knew she needed hurdle work after this massive 800 workout, but she's gonna easily, she explained to me today, I'll go do it in the afternoon, I'll warm up again and do it in the afternoon. And she has no problem that they weren't crunched together on top of each other, whereas other athletes get really, um, sold on the idea of how a workout pattern is written and that that's the only recipe to success. The upside about track is there's a lot of uh, time to practice on your own. The hardest part for me is being a heptathlete. I have to work extra hard twice a day and do all the extra skill work that's provided. So I, I pretty much have two practices a day every day. The average track day for me is I roll out of bed around 5 a.m. I get dressed, I go to practice. We start at 6 a.m. The sun isn't even up by that time. I know uh, in the morning when I come in like a bad mood or I'm just really tired and I decide that I'm gonna be quiet, um, I can always count on Michaela to cheer me up, make me laugh, and we just joke around. It's amazing that she does two sports um, and she's just, I don't know, always positive about everything. It's great. Soccer is kind of nice to transition into. I have the whole summer to get ready and be prepared for it. And then once soccer is over, I have about a month to get prepared for track. And track's completely different. You have to be in different shape. So I don't get to take a lot of time off because once one season ends, I'm on to the next one in less than a month. Resiliency is huge for an athlete that's going to be a multi-athlete or multi-sport athlete or heptathlete, those kinds of things require an athlete to be able to be adaptable and resilient and dedicated as she is in those ways to be successful.